Hello from Branson, Missouri. This week I'm at the Freedom in Christ conference where Kathy and I are speaking and I have the pleasure of introducing you to Neil Anderson who is the founder of Freedom in Christ Ministries and he's the author of at least 500 books on how to be set free. So Neil, I just want you to tell our uh, watchers what is the number one reason that Christians aren't free? Well, people are perishing for lack of knowledge. If you don't know the truth, the truth can't set you free. So obviously that's one. But the other issue is, is that we don't really know who we are in Christ. We don't understand what it means to be a, a child of God. And even then, we haven't really understood how it is that we can experience that freedom in Christ, which is going to require some genuine repentance. Now, repentance sounds like an old term, but Jesus said that we are to believe and repent. And Paul preached repentance everywhere. So it requires repentance, which by definition means a change of mind. But it's a little deeper than that. Uh, actually, when we set forth our steps to freedom in Christ, it's a means to help people connect with God, let Him be the one who convicts us of sins. But two things just stand out right, every time in people's lives. And I would say the number one issue is, is the need to forgive others. Everybody's been hurt. Everybody's been wounded. But what did Jesus prophesy? What, did he, what, what was the great prophecy in Isaiah about our Lord? That He would set captives free and that He would bind up our broken hearts. Now, we got wounded people all over the world. Everybody's been hurt. Everybody's been uh, damaged to a certain extent. And the only answer God has for that is to forgive as Christ has forgiven us. And so when we encourage people to go through this process, ask the Lord to reveal to the mind who it is they need to forgive, almost every person has 10 to 20, sometimes 30 or 40 people they need to do that. Uh, now, this is critically important for all of us because we're trying to bring some healing to our life. But if you're in bitterness, you can't do it. Bitterness is like swallowing poison, hoping the other person will die. Forgiveness is to set a captive free and to realize you are the captive. You're going to be bound to your past unless you come to that point in your life where you say, I'm going to forgive this person and forgive them from my heart. Let God deal with them. He's the avenger. I'm going to get on with my life. So that's the biggest one that we see. Number two, unfortunately, is sexual strongholds. And uh, even the Bible... We'll talk about sexual sins like in a class by itself. Every other sin lies outside the body. So it just keeps coming up again and again and again. And I don't have to convince anybody out there, you know, how deeply entrenched this is in every culture of the world. We uh, market it. We, we watch pornography. Adult education, uh, entertainment is everywhere. It, it's just a mess. People have been abused. Uh, uh, they've been raped. They've been, it's just horrible, folks. But the the key is there's got to be an answer to that and there absolutely is an answer to that and frankly it's Christ but how to connect with him is the key to understanding what it really means to be truly free in Christ and to get rid of all of that uh, mental garbage and all of that uh, pornography maybe I've stuck in my mind or all the imagery that comes uh, as a result of rape and incest there is an answer for that. And, but you have to get back into a righteous relationship with God, and repentance is the means by which we do that. Well, that's fantastic. And this will be liberating to the people watching. But tell us, how can we now get more information about Freedom in Christ Ministries and to order materials that would help people through these steps? Well, uh, our U.S. website, Freedom in Christ Ministry, FICM.org. In Canada, you just add a... CA. That's it. And uh, if you're FICM.ca. Yes. In uh, UK, it's UK. And uh, so we have a great office in Canada. Uh, resources are all across the country. And uh, so if you're watching this at the right time, check in in July because 100 Huntley Street is going to feature me for the whole month of July. <laughs> and uh, we'll be talking about some of these issues. And they're going to make available the book, The Bondage Breaker, The Next Step. So for Canadians, that's watch for 100 Huntley Street in July. And for, uh, and so all these resources are available, and below this video, I'll put links that you can click on to connect to these different websites so you can order materials and become part of the Freedom in Christ ministry. So thanks so much, Neil, for being with us this week. God bless you, brother.